So hi guys, welcome to Multiverse. Today we're going to take our first look at the new Metal DLC. So let's get this party started. So the new Metal DLC was released today. So this is the very first time that I'm logging in. Oh, as you can see, we got some new screens, uh, some new loading screens. That's always nice to see. I have no idea where these uh, come from. So you can see Metal Part 1, there we go. So we could go now or we could dismiss. Ah, let's go now because actually, yeah, let's go now. So I assume it's going to teleport us directly to the uh, the area, the open world area. Again, here's a new uh, loading screen. From what I understand, there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of uh, loading screen that will come from uh, concept art. Metal Part One, Dark Knights, go now. We're already there. Let's try again. It's Oracle. Central City needs your help. Strange weather patterns are disrupting the city, and criminals are taking advantage of the chaos. The speedsters have their hands full, Flash is missing, and I'm trying to piece it all together. Once you get there, I'll send you where you're most needed. So as you can see, we have a, some sort of free gift, so let's open that. Open granted item menu, and we get the artifact celebration pack. Oh yeah, we were supposed to get something because of that. So let's select. So we're going to get 50,000 artifact XP, one seal of completion, three paragon en energies, six quantum quantum field energies, and 11 Dionysiums. They're supposed to have simplified the whole thing with the artifacts. I will make a video soon, uh, as soon as I can about that. So let's claim all these. Grant was successful, so let's go take a look. So you can see we have a little box. Where is it? I have too much stuff, I know. We have our little box over here. The reason why I have so much stuff, I'm going to show you in just a minute. I never made also anything about the augments. So the, tonight, it's going to be the night. Uh, let's consume that. Let's consume some of our Nth Metal, because just to make uh, some room. Uh, let's uh, increase the strength of our Grim uh, Grimorium. So let's do that. Actually, no, let's not. Uh, let's wait a bit. Let's take a look at the artifacts for one second. So they're supposed to have simplified. Yeah, that's it. So basically, we're now to be able to upgrade our artifacts, we're going to need some Paradox Energy, Quantum Field Energy, or Dionysium. We're supposed to be down to only three catalysts, but uh, as you can see, there's, it's still pretty. Like, we need eight Dionysium, seven uh, Quantum Field Energy, and six Paradox Energy. Uh, let's try another artifact, just for the fun of it. Let's try our Grimoire. Oh. Let's try our Grimoire. So you can see as the artifacts goes up in level, the amount of, uh, of catalyst will, will increase. So at, levels, uh, at level 80, we're going to need four, three, two. Uh, let's take a look at our solder. Oh, there we go. So there's some items like the Bottle City Solder. I upgraded it to the maximum. So let's take a quick look. Oh, it's still at the maximum rank. So we they did not increase this one. There was another one. Oh, the Amulet of Rao. I had increased it to the maximum. Okay, so now I could use... Uh, let's use it for the Amulet of Rao then. So I have a whole bunch of Ant Metal. Let's use that. So now we're going to be able to increase it all the way up to rank 200. Let's try again. So this is all the ant metal we had. So again, at rank 180, we're going to need, we're going to we're going to need uh, eight, nine Dionysium, eight Quantum Field Energy, and seven Paradox Energy. And it's basically it's ten marks of victory, uh, ten marks of uh, uh, ten source marks to purchase each. So as it gets, it's going to get pretty pricey. So let us see what's on this little map here. So it mentioned the complete uh, metal part one Scarlet Speedster one player operation. So I guess we're gonna have to do that first. But uh, let's take a look at our little uh, Sam the Snitcher, Sal the Snitch. So this seems to be the elite vendor. So let's try this little guy here. So this seems to... Ah, oh, we can't see it. Let's try the other one. OK, 
Okay, so here we have some uh, adaptive augments that we can purchase. But if I'm not mistaken, usually when we play some of the early missions, we are given at least one new augment, if not two. Oh, metal resonator. So let's get, let's consume that. Complete this mission to collect your new metal resonator. What's a metal resonator? Oh, too far, too far. Oh, so we're going to be able to choose our first augment in here. So let's click on that. Oh yeah. So here we have the one for controller and tank, which increases basically dominate dominance. Uh, we have the might one, we have the precision one, we have the restoration one. But uh, what the one I always take is the controller one. So you can see it's going to give us like a three percent uh, vitalization power while while in anti metal content. It's going to give us uh, one additional gear gear choice. Uh, Harmonize with your allies to unleash uh, its full power. I'm not sure that. So anyway, you can see the description right there. So let's uh, let's use that, and let's open the next one. I for the next one, I, I will choose the very same thing. I'll explain to you why in just a second. So right now, if you look, I have the Vital Dark Phylactery twice. That was for the Justice League Dark DLC. So right now you can see we have the Vital Metal uh, Resonator. Um, not really needed just yet. You can see none of the uh, abilities are actually... Oh, actually, let's try to increase it then. So we should be able to increase the strength of those, uh, those uh, Vital Metal Resonators. And that's why I kept all of that stuff. It's it was to be able to upgrade the, these uh, the, uh, these augments. I knew that with the new DLC we would we would get some new augments. So tonight's the night. We try to upgrade them as much as we can. I'm always torn with uh, should I upgrade one to the max, or should I upgrade the other one? Well, let's upgrade the one to the, as much as we can. So as you can see, I, I was saving my, uh, oh, I was saving my crafting, uh, my crafting components for quite some time. As you can see, my inventory is full, full, full. So it's going to be nice to be able to, oh, perfected exobite, level up your augment faster with the highest quality augment regent available. Perfected exobite, purchase them today on the marketplace. I will take a look at that in just a second. Let's dismiss that. So let's try. Was I did I reach a point where I could upgrade it? Uh, let's see. No, not yet, I suppose. Let's try again. We've reached uh, rank 12 already. One more time. So obviously at, at various ranks, at rank 15, we're going to have to break through again. I think it goes up to rank uh, 25. Uh, it's been a while, so I kind of forget. But we'll take a look. Uh, we can look at our other uh, augments in just a second. It shouldn't be able to tell us. So obviously I'm going to be able to switch my augments, or I'm, I should be able to use uh, some of my augments for the Justice League Dark emissions, and these augments here should be good for the Metal Part 1. Oh, it gives us again that uh, little uh, thing. So I've reached uh, level 15, or the Milestone, so I'm going to need some Dark Electrum and some Dark Speed Force Energy. So these we're going to be able to get them from the metal part one. 
And of course, we're going to use a seal, uh, either a seal of preservation or completion. In this case, I think it's going to be a seal of preservation. But uh, as you saw, there's two of them. So we could start upgrading the other one right away. And uh, not only is my inventory here full, I have a few other characters that are, are full of those uh, components as well. So this is just a, a small fraction of what I can do uh, so far. So for those of you who had questions about the augments, I hope this is uh, going to answer at least some of your questions. Yeah, I click one time too many. It happens. There's a bit of lag in the menu. That should be expected at least for the next uh, couple of days. There's going, to do, there's going to be a lot of new people or a lot of people that will come back to the game. So that will mean a lot of people in the, in the game. There will be a lot of people playing the broker. So there, you should expect a little bit, a little bit of lag or a loading time should, could be a bit longer than usual. Oh, we're almost there. There we go. And I could, if I really wanted to, one thing I could do, let's say for example, like I, right now I have the, uh, oh, wrong one. Right now I have the uh, the augments for the Justice League Dark DLC. We have our augments also for the uh, the Atlantis DLC. I could decide to use the augments to fortify my new augments. Let's say I decide I don't need the uh, the vital ancient coral. I don't need them anymore. I could use them to upgrade my new uh, my new uh, uh, augments. I'm not going to do that just yet. I I, I don't really need to. I have, I have more than enough experience uh, saving the way. Although I could decide that I no longer need the Atlantis uh, the Atlantis augment, and I could decide to consume them. I could have used uh, a lot of those components. I could have used a lot of those components to be able to upgrade my might metagenes, but I, I'm not using it, so it, 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 it's pointless at this point. So again, I, the thing I could do, I could replace until I once I finally upgrade the, these to. Uh, to maybe not to the maximum, but once I start upgrading these, I'm going to replace my. Uh, my augments, actually I probably could replace them right away. At least for this DLC. So as you see it gave us a little feat. The reason why it's a bit pointless to keep the these at least in this content, like you can see here the the Vital Dark Phylactery gave me 3% vitalization and power while in Justice League Dark content. Obviously, we're no longer in Justice League Dark con content, at least on this map. Uh, the same with the gear choice. It gives us additional gear choice. It doesn't apply here. And the same with uh, the arcane defense and everything else. Again, doesn't really apply here. And even the stats, like right now, the new augments pretty much give uh, almost more stats than, though, than the, the, the old ones. So uh, for this content, there's little incentive to, to keep on using uh, the Vital Dark Phylactery. But I, I, I would be tempted to keep those for the Justice League Dark uh, missions. Uh, we'll see. And of course, as I mentioned, uh, for here... Oh yeah, I should have checked if I can upgrade those. Well, let's give it a try. Oh, actually, I didn't have the option. Yeah, did I? Well, let's see. I probably went a bit too quick. Oh, so I can... Uh, so I had me reach the maximum with those, uh, those augments. The vital metagene. But it seems that we're going to be able to upgrade them at least a little bit more. And same with the artifacts, I suppose. So for the artifacts, we should be able to go all the way up to rank 200. And for the augments, I'm not sure how far, how much further we're going to be able to go. Right now we're at rank 237. So let's see how far we can go. Also, oh, I was going to say, uh, when you get into this map, if you're a low-level player, it will raise your combat rating. But as you can see, my combat rating is 270. It's the, very same combat, it's the same combat rating I had before. So sadly, in my case, it doesn't increase my combat rating. 
and let's take a quick look at the so use the on duty menu to cure for the complete metal part one scarlet speedster operation let's do that so we got here the uh, the event version obviously since i'm a legendary player i'm going to play the regular version so let's get this party started I don't think I'll play all the missions today, but I could be wrong. Today is a good day to try all the missions. Uh, everyone is going to cure for those missions. Everyone needs those missions today. This weird weather has brought out the worst in Central City's criminals. Strangely, weather wizards nowhere in sight. They're robbing banks, stores, you name it. The police could use a hand. Even the city's speedsters can't be in two places at once. So, as you can see, we have a new version of uh, Central City. Stop them. Not sure what that was about. Shots fired. Send backup. Stop, police officer. Oh, we have the red skies. That's nice. Now I'm mad. So obviously we got some Dark Knight, some Capsule, and we got a Prometheum Lockbox. Ooh, that's nice. It uh, liberated my inventory quite a bit. Uh, well, let's go for the Vault Ticket. It'll be a free source mark. Help. Shots fired! Need backup! Stop right there! Police! Terrible. Make this easy and give me all your cash. So I'm not sure what's going to be the difference between this version and the uh, the events version. Shots usually there's fired. a few uh, usually Stop there's a few right mechanics there, that we have in the regular version that we don't have in the events version. Uh, maybe I should compare the two. Uh, obviously, there's something I'm not doing right. Let's try to stop the bugging. Thank you, hero. I see something up here. Aha. That looks like a dead drop. Confiscate the package and I'll call in law enforcement to secure it. So just so you know, this is my very first time here. I haven't watched any videos about how, uh, about what to expect. So we're discovering that together. Odds are you, you guys. Need backup. Odds are you guys know more about Stop me right about this Police. than I do. Make this easy. Give me all your cash. So I guess we have to do all the uh, little white dots we see on the map. Is they're under its control. Oh, the citizens have transformed. Well, let's see what that means. In case you don't know, this here usually is the area for evil villains, at least in the regular version of Central City. And we still even have uh, some vendors. Oh, let's repair. I'm a bit curious, so I usually try to have a look. Uh, just uh, sort of vendor it seems let's continue oh, let's try to see if it's the same size as the oh yeah it's the same size so it's really this very same map as we uh, what we usually have but obviously with different content in it Civilian. Ah! What 
one of the things I love about Quantum, even when you play as a DPS, you still have quite a bit of crowd control, as you Just can see. Just picked up a surge of energy from the Flash Museum. They've got the actual cosmic treadmill locked away there. That's got to be tied to these Speed Force storms. Check it out. Uh, we will check it out, but um, let's take a quick look around just in case. We might see something interesting. But maybe not. It's another, another guy. So I guess nothing really worth uh, looking at. So let's go to the museum. It belongs in a museum! Sorry, I got carried away. Oh, Mirror Master. Is it going to be the, the dark metal version? Or it not? Looks like Mirror Master is under the influence of that weird metal. At least we know he's not behind this. You've got to stop that. Let's summon our little friend because we can. Oh. Help! Help! Oh, let's try something. Museum's got that to was have close. some answers. Watch your back in there. So we could choose a piece of gear, or we could use You've a gener gener me. generator mod. I'll go for the mod. Uh, I've maxed the mods from the Justice League Dark uh, DLC, but not, not obviously not on this uh, this DLC. So let's grab a mod. I'm not sure how rare the mods are, so I, maybe I made a mistake. Maybe it was the right call. We'll uh, we'll find out soon enough. I'm almost tempted to switch to my shield armory. If you're wondering uh, the main distinction, I have a lot of shields that I can use with this character that I can't use, use with the other one. This is more of a defensive character. Or defensive armory, I should say. going to have to explore or do we just use a oh let's explore a bit first time we explore sorry about that so they still have uh, the little vendor here like the regular version so let's just repair you found flash Something's not right. Can't stop myself. Must obey. In my world, I strapped the Flash to the hood of my Batmobile and drove into the Speed Force. Gaining his powers made me a better, deadlier Batman. But I still have his annoying voice stuck in my head. I'm going to enjoy watching another Flash squirm. Think you can keep up? Catch me if you can. Got to save Flash. I think the cosmic treadmill's been opening those weird portals. Can't be that simple. Fading fast. Batman combined with the Flash, but evil? It's like a nightmare.
If that's a Batman, he won't be as experienced with Flash's rogues. Go to the exhibits. We can build a device to help you fight him. Hey, I know this place. Oh. My research reveals warnings that make me wonder if the metal should be destroyed. There is talk of a great bat god, Barbatos. One who brings darkness and cannot be stopped. The metals are the key that unlocks Barbatos. He is the darkness. So if you've ever, ever been in the Flash Museum, uh, you can see they've, they've linked uh, both uh, both part of the museum, museum together. Normally you only have access to one part or the other. So you can see what I meant uh, by having uh, some crowd control even in DPS role. You can see I can juggle a, a lot of enemies. Uh, even as a DPS. Well, let's clear out the map as much as we can. Explore a bit. I like to explore when I can. Nah, we can't go here. So sad, so sad. Oh, that's a nice statue. Uh, I wish we could have it. Not sure why they gave us the Superman statue, but there is a similar Batman statue, and uh, as we just saw, Flash uh, statue. Maybe they'll give us uh, some of those eventually as uh, base items. Ah, oh, there's nothing. So sad. I probably should hurry. Maybe there's a timer that I don't know about. You guys sometimes uh, mentioned that you, you would like to have more lantern powers uh, there's a few ways to be able to fake uh, having lantern powers for example quantum is a pretty good power to fake having uh, blue lantern powers so if you ever want to make a blue lantern character uh, using uh, quantum would be a good option I've seen people Looks also like use the mechanisms uh, on that door have shorted out if you can find something nearby that's connected to the system, fixing it should open the door. So if you use the blue lantern power, you could use uh, you could create a blue lantern character. But I've seen people sometimes use uh, water powers for that. So you decide. As long as it looks blue, yeah, why not? So I guess this is what we're supposed to use. Let's go back again. So 
I guess we choose which part of tech we want. Well, let's try this one. Uploaded schematics. Pick one of the rogues' power types from the exhibits to give you an edge. Decisions, decisions. Well, let's go with this one. You guys remember we were when we fought the Pied Piper when we were tier two, he was using that kind of uh, energy, and the the thing he uh, I, I clicked on was uh, one of his, uh, one of his generator in the police uh, in the central city police uh, department. I probably should have taken the ice, but uh, uh, next time. I'm sure we'll play this mission a lot, so I'll have the opportunity to try all the weapons eventually. Oh, I hear something. today who still worship the bat god they call themselves the court of owls once a part of the hawk tribe they betrayed their tribe for their bat god today they use the rare metal electrum to grant their agents eternal life there oh yes no idea what that feat was supposed to be but we'll take it to enter the darkness beyond our universe. Once again, I will take my torch into the unknown to find a way to fight the darkness. So uh, we have one healing barrel over there, so let's see. Your new toys aren't clever. I am Batman and Flash. I'll always be one step ahead of you. Classic Batman. Don't let him get under your skin.
Not sure if I'm supposed to get them all or just as much as I can. Oh no, the barrel, the barrel. Oh, he broke my barrel. He's so mean. <laughs> Come on. Just a minor. I'm not sure why I can target him uh, for a bit. And I bet. This has been fun, but I think it's time to vibrate your hearts out of your chests. I. Ah, no! Flash, get out of my head and stop singing that song! Oh, Red Death. So disappointing. Welcome to the beginning of the end. We are going to have so much fun! And by we, I mean all the Dark Knights who are coming to your world. <laughs> this is a nightmare. I don't know what that thing was, but we've got to stop it. I'll confer with the Justice League and get back to you. I'll be on this 24-7. No way I'll be able to sleep after seeing that, that Batman who laughs. So let's see what's in the old treasure box. Uh, just some source marks. Better than nothing, I suppose. So we've got some solid metal exobites to be able to uh, to boost our augments. And now we have to exit the Flash Museum. Uh, I hope I didn't forget any uh, anything important. But uh, we'll play this mission quite a lot, so let's get out of here. Oh, and it brings us back here. Let's go see if... Uh, sometimes we're stuck in the event. That's what I thought. So let's leave. And uh, I'm curious to see where the portal is in the watchtower to be able to go back. So let's go take a look. So this time it's... Is it here? It's on the other side. Oh yes. Now let's see what vendor we have here. So here we have the Entropic uh, Chrono. I'm not sure what, what style that's supposed to be. I think that's going to be the... Uh, oh, I forgot his name. The Blue Evil Red... Uh, the, the Blue Evil uh, Dark Metal character. And you can see there's a bunch of base items. So this should be a scalable gear that goes up to item level 32. I'm not sure what my item level are. I think it's 225. Yeah, 235. So the gear sadly here is uh, not as good as the one I have because I have the one that I purchased from the Justice League Dark Vendor. So you can see they've uh, pretty much have changed a whole bunch of uh, of the loading screens. Never thought the penguin had only two this fingers. This is even worse than Central City. I compared my projections with calculator of all people, and we're in agreement that mind controlling metal is a global pandemic. No matter how distasteful, it's going to take Earth's heroes and villains working together to stop this threat. Like we've never heard that before. It's weird nowadays to think that the calculator is a Felicity Smoke's uh, father. Way back when, when DC Universe Online just started, that wasn't the case, but now it is. So that's going to be it for now, guys. Uh, we're, going, we're going to continue next time. Next time, I'll probably try to uh, explore the map over here, which seems to be uh, an alternate version of uh, Met Metropolis, but in the dark, at night. 
Was it Metropolis? Oh, it looks like uh, Gotham again. Oh well. It looks like the Gotham from Earth 3 somehow. Anyway, we'll explore that a bit more next time. So next time we'll talk to our friend uh, Nightwing. And we'll explore the map over here uh, at, least, uh, at least a bit. So that's going to be pretty much it for now, guys. So as always, thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.